Everyone, my name is Python GB. Welcome back to the 20th episode of my Terraria Ranger playthrough. I do hope I can do that right, because if not, then I will be majorly embarrassed. But in this episode, what we're going to be doing is we are going to be defeating the pirate invasion, and then hopefully afterwards, we're going to farm out some souls of light and night, and then maybe we can perhaps try to take down Skeletron Prime, which I believe might be quite difficult because obviously he's got loads of flailing arms that will do multiple amounts of damage and. Ugh. It can get a bit hairy, but without further ado, I already have my uh, my houses all cordoned off with a bit of stone, as you can see. So hopefully they shouldn't be able to get in. So my NPCs should be good for the most part. So without further ado, let's go ahead and let's get on with this thing. Okay, so we're going to be fighting them here for the most part. We do indeed have a whole bunch of ammo and guns and such to use. We've got the Adamantite Repeater, Superior Mega Shark, the old Clockwork Assault Rifle, and uh, the Harpoon. Although, to be honest, I don't see why I would be using that. We also need to get rid of this snow stuff, because obviously that is the uh, the remnants of the old Frost Legion. Because, you know, that's a thing they do. They kind of uh, litter your landscape with snow blocks. So... Yeah, <laughs> let's get rid of it all. There we go. Hello, Mr. Slime. There you go. The pirates are among us. I am currently. Oh my God! There's already a. What the hell? There's already a captain. There's already a captain. This is not fair. Okay. We can do this. I firmly believe that we can do this. All we gotta do is take the captain down. We should be good to go, right? Okay, this could actually get very, very hairy. Um, right. Okay, let's go in here, shall we? Come on. All of you get killed. Oh, God, he's shooting blooming cannonballs. Oh, my God. Okay, that captain's a pain in the ass, isn't he? Come on. Captain, I am taking you out of the game, whether you like it or not. Stop trying to avoid your fate, buddy. This is not acceptable. I am not dying today. Oh my god, I might actually die today. The pirates! They are difficult! Oh my god! Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, please, please, please. Uh, hearts, hearts! No hearts! Ah! Ah! Uh, 70 health is not a lot, is it? Ah! Okay. Oh! <laughs> oh! Okay, this is, this is getting a little bit out of hand. Okay, hi. Ah, uh, okay, and health, there we go. Ooh. Hi, how are you all doing? If we could all die, that'd be great. Thank you very much indeed, and I'll see you next time. There we go. Ah, oh, good lord, there's so many guys. <laughs> they won't stop. They won't stop until I'm dead. This is, this is not nice, my friends. Well, at least I'm getting a bunch of presents doing this as well. This is kind of cool. Hello, y'all are dead. There we go. A golden bathtub. Ooh, interesting stuff. All right, now, did the thing actually die? Did the... I don't even know if the captain died. I didn't hear him. I didn't hear his splat. His splat of death. That is what I did not hear. All right. Wait, can we even get any ranged weapons from the pirate invasion? I have a feeling the answer is no. You can get the cutlass, the pirate staff. Oh, we can get the coin gun. But let's be honest, we are probably never going to get that because that's like a one in... Was it one in 8,000 drop? If we get that, I am literally the luckiest person alive. And also, that will be the very, very first time I've ever got it in the entire time I've played Terraria. So, yeah, it really would be awesome, but let's be honest, it's probably not going to happen. Oh, not another one. Careful. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Okay, he's got less than half health at this point. Come on, pirate. Captain. Captain's out of the game. There we go. And health. I ain't dying to that guy. <laughs> He's such a jerk bag. All he wants is my death. He wants my head. So, yeah, that's a thing. All right. Keep it going, buddies. Keep it going. This gun is actually really good against them, especially with the meteor bullets. And obviously, I have all the my uh, stuff that reduces the chance of actually using ammo. So that's pretty cool. I guess the other thing I could potentially buy is the uh, is the ammo box. Now, I believe you get that from the traveling merchant. So... The next time we have the traveling merchant come in this world, I am going to see what he has. Because if he has the ammo box, I'm going to buy it. Because I'm pretty sure that gives you a uh, a further chance of not using ammo. So, he's very nice indeed, if I do say so myself. 
Okay, keep it going. I'm taking some major hits. Okay, keep it going. Do, 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 do. All the good stuff in the world. Hello. Oh, there's two of you. <laughs> okay. Oh, just had two of you. That's fine. That's fine. Where are you, you silly fool? That is it. The pirate invasion is done, my friends. Oh, <laughs> oh, traveling merchant. Okay, where are you? I wish to see what you are selling, buddy. It is it is midday. Why? Okay. Hmm. Ammo box. No. Revolver. What? How come I've never seen that in there? But I'm gonna buy that. <laughs> I'm gonna buy it and see what it does because I've never had a revolver before. This should certainly be interesting. So, it's twenty-five gold. Okay. Oh, we've got a whole bunch of gold anyway, so I could have bought that anyway. Oh, good stuff, Python. You are very good at looking at what's in your inventory. You're so good, in fact, that you make me want to cry. <laughs> oh, man. Hello. Hi. Boom. Wow, look at that. Oh, yeah, what's so good about it? <laughs> what? I don't, I don't even get it. Why have I got two pone hammers? I don't need two pone hammers. Get out of it, you stupid thing. What is that? They're both regular ones, so eh, get out of it. Right, okay. 25% crit chance. That's pretty cool. So, it does 25% crit chance by default? That's pretty cool, in which case... Huh. Eye patch. Oh, yeah! Look at me! I look pretty cool with an eye patch on, don't I? <laughs> oh, that is sweet. I'm keeping that on. I'm keeping the eye patch on. That is definitely awesome. Right, okay, here we go. Let's see what we get. Oh my god, a tree mask? Oh my god, this is so cool. Alright, so we've got star anises, which we are allowed to use because of range damage. We have another snow globe for the old Frost Legion. We have a Santa, well, Mrs. Claus suit. We've got some gingerbread cookies. Oh, I got some awesome stuff from that. That's not too bad. Okay, sweet. We might be able to make the rest of the frost armor today, ladies and gentlemen. If we are quick and get to the snow biome in time, we could potentially kill two ice golems, get the frost claws, and then, go absolutely ham on these on those dudes. Okay, where's the old snow? There's snow! Here we go. Right, now we need to try and get the old ice golem. Now, when the hell is he going to spawn? That is the question. Alright, buddy. Come on, Mr. Ice Golem. I know you want to spawn, buddy. Uh, what if I just make, like, a little AFK area or something? Oh, that might work. Do, 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 big AFK area. There we go. And now we wait. <laughs> we literally wait for them to spawn. I have literally got nothing else to do until he spawns, I guess. Oh, man. Alrighty, guys. As I just said, I'm probably just going to AFK here for a little bit of time until the guy hopefully spawns. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take them down twice. Over. And then we're going to make the rest of the frost armor. And then hopefully take down Skeletron Prime. So, I shall see you guys. Hopefully when one spawns. Ooh, I see you down there. You can't blame and get away from me, fool! Oh, there we go. Ow. Okay, this guy can actually do some serious damage. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, here we go. Get killed! Ow! I'm frozen on the spot, you jerk! He's get, it gets quicker as he goes along. And health. Ah! It frees me on the spot. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yes, he's dead! One frost core. Okay, that's good stuff. Right, can we get another one to spawn pretty quickly? If we can, then we might actually be able to take down Skeletron Prime on this coming night. Right, give me that. Give me that present. Thank you very much. Right, okay, here we go. Uh... Oh man, we're going to have to be so lucky for him to spawn. But I guess without further ado, we are just going to wait, I guess, again. Until hopefully he spawns again. So, I shall see you guys if we do manage to find him again. Oh my lord, there's a nice golem in the water. Okay, that uh, makes a whole lot of sense. Let me tell you. Just got to kill him. Come on, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. No, I don't need that blooming possessed armor to get in my way. Come on! Okay, press number five and shoot him. 
Come on! Oh, I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! No! 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 I am saying to you now, no, you are not killing me, sir. Ah! Oh, you kill me with melee, I will murder you if you kill me. Alright, here we go. Ah! No, no, no! <laughs> oh god, no! Bad way. I'm in a bad way. Did he despawn? If he despawn, I'm gonna be even more angry. He despawned, didn't he? Oh, he's down there! Yeah. Okay, if I just stay right here, and health. Right, Ice Elemental, get the hell out of here. You absolute ass. Must kill Ice Golem. Don't freeze me! Ooh. Come on! He must be nearly dead. Is he dead? Okay, I think I got him. Oh my god! What an absolute pain in the ass. Right, okay, let's get home. Let's get the hell home. Okay, where's the... Uh, I don't even know when the moon, has, moon is at. Okay, um... I gotta go, man. I gotta do this thing. If I don't do it now, then I'll never do it. So... Oh, I really need full health. Nurse, 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 nurse. Where's the nurse? Nurse, nurse. Where are you at? Where? Where, 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 where? Where? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Quickly, 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 quickly. Come on, come on, come on. All right, heal. Good stuff, good stuff. All right, here we go. We're going to do it anyway. Okay. Iron skin. Skeletron Prime. Why am I doing this now? This is such a bad idea. <laughs> here we go. I would really like to take him down today. Because if I can, then I'll be able to do a whole bunch of stuff like making the pickaxe axe, get some chlorophyte stuffs, and, you know, hopefully eventually get myself some shroomite armor. Because that's the ultimate range of armor, isn't it? Indeed. Come on, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? There you are. There you are. There you are. There you are. Come on. I might actually try. I might actually have to try and get his arms off first. Because, uh, you know, they do a lot of damage against me. Okay, and health. Okay, focus down his head. There we go. Unfortunately, when he starts spinning, his defense actually increases quite a lot. Unlike his normal counterpart, where it actually decreases. God damn it. Come on. Oh, man. There's two ways I could die. I will either die to him or I'll run out of time and he'll still kill me just because he turns into dungeon... Was it Dungeon Guardian Prime? Something like that. Oh, careful. Come on, man. I might have well over half health, but he can still deal with that to me in a fairly large... Well, it's a short amount of time, shall I say. Come on. Keep it going. As you can see, he's doing a bunch of damage. Okay, I'm now in space again. God damn it. <laughs> Come back down! There you are. He is coming up to half health. Which I guess is cool. And health. There we go. Okay, he's got less than half health at this point. Come on, come on, come on. Again, if I go quiet for any extended amount of time, I apologise. But once again, it's because I'm actually trying to concentrate this guy. I have a feeling I'm going to run out of crystal bullets. Honestly. i got to get out of it, because... I've still got 35 seconds and I've got less than half health. That's, I'm not looking good right now. Pew, pew, pew. So much pew. Okay, get back down to the regen area. Really need to try and stay around it for a little, t little, little while. Okay, come on, careful. Your stupid ass arms floating around like idiots. Wait, where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, man. Careful. And health. Still got around half health, so still got to be careful. How much has he got? 6,000 health. Okay, he should be able to do this, right? Should be able to, being the operative word. Or phrase, shall I say. Come on, keep it going, keep it going. 5,000 health. I will take him down. I want to take him down. If I take him down, I'm going to be the happiest guy in the world. Come on. This is just with a mega shark as well. This shouldn't be too difficult. 
It's just his arms. His arms are the ones that are doing damage. His head is barely ever doing damage to me. He's at 2,000 health right now. How many crystal bullets? 134. Actually, that's lasted for longer than I first thought. Not bad. Not bad. Ow. Okay. Keep it going. 1,500 health. You're coming back down here, right? Yes. Yes. All right. Good stuff. Is he dead? He's got 300 health. And... He's done! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, hello. I got a bit hairy at multiple times, but... Uh, I think we did a good job of taking him down. Oh, man. You have no idea how happy I am I've actually done that now. Because I don't think I'll need to take him down again for the rest of the series. Well, at least I hope so. Just trying to think. Do I need... I need Souls of Fright for the Naughty Present for the Frost Moon. But apart from that, I don't think I need it for anything. I hope I'm right in thinking that, honestly. I hope I'm right. Uh, okay, let's go down here and see what we've got in our hard mode stuff chest. 83 hallowed bars. Okay. Souls of Sight. Souls of Might. And then, of course, we have Souls of Fright. We should be able to make the Pickaxe Axe. And then hopefully also make the rest of the frost armor. We can actually wear it and get some cool things going. <laughs> oh, baby. Here we go. Pickaxe axe. Fantastic. Not so fantastic. It's a bad one. Yeah, of course you'd give me a bad one, wouldn't you? You jerk. Right, okay, here we go. Leggings and, of course, the chest plate. Awesome sauce. And we still have some remaining for some other things. What else can we use hallowed bars for? A hallowed repeater, possibly. I mean, it does do increased damage. What have we got? That's a good one as well. There we go. Hey, I'm alright with that. Staunch. 63 damage. Nice stuff. Let's put this on and see how much it does again. 61 damage. It does less damage? What? How is that possible? Uh, let me put these back on. So that does 63. And that does 61. But every time you hit an enemy, they get the Frostburn debuff. So... I don't know, man. I don't, I don't know if the Frost Armor was actually worth making. Maybe I should have made the Hallowed Range set. Ooh, that was possibly a big mistake on my part. But oh well, it doesn't matter. It does not matter. Can we make anything ranged with Souls of Fright? Let's have a look really quick. Alright, here we go. What have we got? Uh, a Flamethrower? A Flamethrower? Ooh, that could be interesting. <laughs> Illegal gun parts. Can we buy them? Oh, no, it's no longer... Oh, it's not nighttime anymore. God damn it. Oh, man. Well, oh, well, doesn't matter too much. We have ourselves a full set of frost armor. We also have defeated Skeletron Prime. We have ourselves a hallowed repeater and, of course, a, uh, a pickaxe axe. Oh, no, I'm going to reforge the pickaxe axe because I would really like to get something good because I imagine I'm going to be using that for a fairly long amount of time until we get the pixel, of course. So I would like something decent, something with speed on it. Yep. That's, that's good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Legendary pickaxe axe. You could not get even better than that. That is fantastic. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'm going to wrap up the episode right there. Thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy the episode, and of course you're excited to see more, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And of course you can subscribe if you want to know when the future videos are out. I think in the next episode we're going to do a couple of things. We're going to try and get the, uh, the, oh, what's his name? The Mushroom Dude to spawn, the Truffle, we're going to try and get him to spawn by making a Mushroom Biome on the surface. And uh, then we're also going to go to the Underground Jungle and see what's going on there with the old Chlorophyte. But, that is going to wrap it up guys. Thank you very much for watching, I appreciate you guys' continued support, and I will see you guys in the next episode. <laughs>